Capricorn, hello, how are you? This is your weekend tarot reading. So we're going to go into the energy of the tarot. We're going to see what message we get for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Um, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for supporting. And thanks for sharing the channel as well with anyone that you think might be interested because it does help me keep the channel going. So thank you. Um, so let's see uh, what we get here. Uh, let's actually just pick an overall energy card first. Hmm. <laughs> I keep doing that. I think I need to move the deck around <laughs> because then I'll pick the right one up first. I'll move that one there. <laughs> That's better. Okay, so my tarot decks are very sensitive, so they get used to being where they are on the table and I can't, you know, <laughs> I have to make sure that they're happy. <laughs> okay. Oh dear. Right, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. You've got... um. A card here now I funnily enough I think you had this one yesterday fair decisions so something keeps coming up from the spirit of the tarot to let you know you're making the right choices here um, your angels are aware that you have concerns but be assured there's nothing to worry about stand your ground and know that heaven is shining its divine light upon the situation and all is being healed take the time to review all the details thoroughly forgiveness will bring peace to everyone involved Okay, so it's very nice energy, um, beautiful actually. Um, so, you know, you're also um, you're also being called to um, speak. Okay, you sort of got King of Swords energy here. So you may have to because um, you've got the Decision card and you've got this card here. You may have to. Um, make decisions or communications that are very important and you have to be very clear but spirit is right with you saying that they will help you to have clarity of mind and clarity of speech uh, when you need to, to do okay so this is good um, let's go a little bit deeper now oh we've got a tiny card <laughs> a tiny card hidden now there's somebody connected to you that doesn't want to let go death card in reverse they don't really want to let go of you because um, an bottom of the deck there somebody disappointed somebody disappointed somebody not wanting to let go of you perhaps they're realizing they've made a mistake um, now your energy you're healing very nicely and um, you're having lots of awakening experiences at the moment Capricorn now there may be a child or somebody younger than you or more immature and they do want a connection with you this is somebody who's very attracted to your energy or they're very vibrant and they like spending time with you um, and basically yeah they're trying to offer you something they're trying to step forward and um, now um, you're liberating yourself from feeling very stuck okay and a lot of the mind activity and the things that was keeping you stuck dissipating um, and you've got this awakening card again so Capricorn big awakening for you at the moment I feel like you're starting to fall in love with yourself again you're starting to feel your own energy because you're honoring your needs um, now it's making you more lovable um, it's making you more attractive um, also more connected to spirit so I feel for Capricorn uh, people wanting to spend time with you again whether it's family members or you know this could be a new uh, partner coming in now there is definitely somebody here who doesn't want to let go of you and they're quite disappointed they may regret the decision they made or they may regret how they spoke to you, um, something like that. You've got here from the Lover's Oracle, trust. Transformation occurs through acceptance. Once you accept the current situation, it will automatically transform. Okay, so something about to transform. The more you trust, the more it's going to transform because, um, you know, trust energy is spirit and when we just go into trust it's like we're saying to spirit okay um you take care of it then and then spirit can then spirit can take care of it but if we're not in that trust energy it's hard for spirit to do the work you see so um i feel spirit here the tarot saying to capricorn relax trust that's going to allow spirit to come in and resolve these issues for you 
Um, there's somebody here that really wants to be part of your life. And somehow it will work, you know. Let's have a look at... Um, And with the Ace of Cups, it can always mean a new person coming in as well. <laughs> this is lovely. I know we will be together. So there's somebody that doesn't want to let go of you. I mean, this could even be a family member or platonic person in your life, but somehow this person feels that you'll be together. Um, but to be honest with you, uh, I mean, that's a beautiful message, but also you've got the message here about your own awakening and your own energy becoming more clear and, and loving and spiritual, you know. So Capricorn, I feel relationships are going to be improving for you. Uh, ooh. <laughs> From my consciousness deck. Okay, this message, don't tell yourself negative stories. Okay. So just notice when the mind, because the mind loves to do that, it loves to play with us. <laughs> it's the nature of the ego, it likes to tell us negative stories of the past, so, um, or even negative stories to do with the future. Don't listen to them, you've got a lovely energy, you've got a very spiritual energy, and things are going to be improving for you. Um, you could receive a loving message over the weekend, or you could just feel vibrationally more aligned to love, and um, there's somebody here that definitely wants you in their life, okay? So that's the message, Capricorn. If you do like it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. If you'd like a one-to-one -one tarot, we can book you in. Um, all the subscribes, all the sharing of the channel and all the booking in really helps me keep the channel going. Sending you so much love and peace for your weekends. Uh, one love, Capricorn.